The Africa project aims to improve how mental health is diagnosed and treated. It uses tailored questions, advanced statistical and machine learning methods to get to a quick and accurate diagnosis. The goal of the Africa project is to produce a scalable digital tool to inform measurement-based mental health care for adolescents. Well, quite simply, it's mental health care that responds to a person's evolving needs for mental health support by measuring the nature and severity of their personal challenges in an accurate way and being able to repeat that measurement at different time points to see whether they're getting better or worse. Around 27% of South Africans live with mental health disorders. Anxiety and depression are the most common. This 65-year-old Kimberly woman, whose identity is hidden due to the stigma around the illness, says she has been struggling with depression and bipolar disorder for most of her life. It's better now because I'm on treatment. I think if people would go earlier to the doctor to go find out their symptoms, they will be out so that they can be, live a better life than the, the people that want to kill themselves won't be able to do it because of the tablets, the tablets help. An expert says the tool will make a difference and can potentially save lives. In South Africa we have high rates of suicide, most especially in teenagers, in adolescents. And I think it's very important that we assess, we're able to assess their risks before. And I think this tool can be able to help us to close that gap when it comes to providing mental health services to our adolescents. The new tool on the horizon is expected to be a game changer once fully rolled out. Right now, the project is still in development, but the researchers say the advanced version will only be available next year. The next phase is testing how effective it works in real-world settings. Warren Engelbrecht, SABC News, Kimberley.